Firstly, I was planning to make this entire birthday vlog in this video only, but I feel it is going to get really, really long. So I've decided to break it into two parts. So this will be the pre-birthday vlog and then I'll post the birthday vlog after that. So just stay tuned for that and wish me good luck for the coming year. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the first vlog of this channel. Now it has been a very very long time that I have not uploaded any video or shown this face on any social media. It's uh, initially started with a little break and then it kept on continuing for one reason or the other. But uh, that will be a talk for a whole another video. For now, we'll just uh, continue with the birthday vlog. Yes, it is my yeah. birthday in seven days from today. Uh, now today is uh, 5th February, Saturday and the next Saturday that is 12th of February is my birthday and I'm gonna turn 22 this year. It doesn't feel good to say that but uh, yeah, I'm turning 22 this year and I had a lot of things planned for my birthday this time but then... Um, as always, uh, nothing goes according to my plan and a little something happened. Uh, I'll share everything in this vlog. So uh, continue watching this video till the very very end to see uh, what all I do on my birthday. We'll see that together. There, There's not very much that I'm gonna do but the little something that I'll do, I wanted to share it with you all and it was yesterday night that this thought struck my head to why not just vlog my birthday. And so I have already shopped for my birthday dress and a little bit other things uh, a few days back and I didn't vlog it because as I said it was just yesterday night that this thought struck me and I'm not sure if I'm, I'll be able to vlog successfully because I haven't vlogged ever in my life. But uh, I will try to do uh, whatever uh, best I can. So you can drop your wishes in the comment box below. And as a birthday gift, just hit that red subscribe button and click the notification bell right next to it. It would mean the world to me. You'll get notified every time I upload a new video. And hopefully that would be more frequent now. I will try my best this time. Now without any further ado, let's just dive right into my birthday vlog. I'm very, very excited. As I said, I already shopped a little few things for my birthday a few days back and uh, I had something planned for today as well but because my brother wanted to join me and uh, he is not free right now and I had a little time with me so I decided to just show you all what all I got few days back uh, and all of this I'm gonna view on my birthday of course the birthday haul part one begin because obviously if I'm gonna go out today I'll buy something today as well so the part one is here so the first thing that I got was this white chicken curry kurta it is not pure white uh, but off-white cream sort of the color and it has a very basic neck also it is a straight kurta and it is very very pretty but I don't know what I was thinking while buying this and I got a very very uh, huge size for me I guess I got two sizes up I was not able to try it because of the time issues uh, that day so I just got it and uh, now today I'll have to go and exchange it now apart from that kurta everything is from west side so the first thing I got from west side is this black t-shirt it is a full sleeve t-shirt uh, with a very basic round neck and it is a very basic t-shirt which says be amazing shirt and along with that I got a pair of trouser it is a jogger again in black color very very simple plain basic and uh, it also has 03 printed on this and the other uh, one also had 03 printed on this so it is kind of a quad set and I really really liked it and I got it in the size medium this thing that I got uh, is a pair of denim joggers now I wear denim a lot lot but I always prefer skinny jeans I have never never tried anything regular fit or the mom jeans uh, boyfriend jeans flared jeans i haven't tried any of those yet um i never thought comfortable uh, wearing that so i just wanted to go out of my comfort zone this time so i got a pair of joggers now these are very very loose fit and uh, it has a cinch here so this thing i really like a lot so i yeah i got these pair of joggers and i tried it and 
trust me i just love joggers i'm gonna go and pick up another shade in this definitely i absolutely love this one the last pair of clothing that i got is a dress it is a very very basic dress it is a black and white striped dress and it goes all the way down below my knees it is a mid length uh, and it also has this waistband here and uh, it has a v neckline so i have never tried a v neckline i always go for round necks but as i said this time i wanted to explore something out of my comfort zone so i picked it up uh, and it is a very very basic dress nothing very fancy now i also got an accessory i ordered it off of amazon now it is uh, something like this okay it is a layered chain uh, it has a small heart pendant then a, a chunky chain and then a lock pendant here so it is a layered chain now again something i haven't ever worn like you wouldn't have uh, seen me wearing anything in my neck ever ever like i don't wear accessories that much uh, sometimes i just put on some earrings i don't wear necklaces or uh, uh rings or uh, anything in my hands or something so but yeah uh, i just i just wanted to feel fancy on my birthday so i just got that i don't know if i'll wear it or not but uh, yeah that is another thing now, uh, now i got a little something from uh, miniso as well so i got these four nail paints uh, this is a 04 pure white this is 556 cochineal uh, it is a very pretty red shade uh this one is a nude pink 28 and uh this one is peachy beige 06 uh, this is what i'm wearing on my nails right now and it's a very very pretty beige color very pretty nude color so these were the four nail paints that i got then i got a set of oil absorbing sheets because an oily skin like me needs this i need it in my bag every time all time another thing i got is this perfume from miniso this is their shine perfume iceland aurora so i tried it there and i really like the fragrance it is a 50 ml bottle for 460 rupees uh and it it smells really beautiful a oh, very very beautiful now i don't know how to explain scents that much because i'm not a lot into perfume i have just started developing my taste uh but this This is something I really really like. Now I I just cannot explain the fragrance but you you go to Miniso and try it out. It is a really really beautiful scent. So, so uh, the last thing that I got are these two pair of lenses. Now I haven't uh, tried lenses ever in my life. This will be the first time that I'm going to wear lenses and as I said I just wanted to feel fancy on my birthday. Uh so yeah, I'll just try lenses uh, for once. This one is in the shade Mystery Hazel. now this has green uh, yeah it is a green lens uh, now i am very skeptical about using it i don't know how it will look on me but uh, yeah i'll try it on my birthday and this one is spicy gray it is a gray color uh, as the name suggest uh, so i feel uh, both of them look very very pretty uh, i just don't know if they'll suit me or not but uh, we'll have to wait and see so yeah this was uh, all about what i got for my birthday now uh, about uh, today's plan so what i'm going to uh, do today is i've decided to get a tattoo today uh it will be my first ever tattoo like i have i have planned for getting a tattoo for so so long but uh, for some reason or the other i just couldn't uh, mostly because my father was not allowing for it but finally he just agreed to it and i was so so happy so yeah today i'm going to go and get a tattoo so i'll take you guys along with me but uh, it will be in a while because uh, apparently my brother is not free right now so we'll go in a while so i'll catch you then okay so finally i'm out of the house and i'm all set to go so i've taken the kurti that needs to be exchanged my wallet my phone my mask and now i'm all set to go so i'll catch you once i reach the mall Okay, so I finally reached the mall, but unfortunately, the shop from which I bought my kurti, this one, this stall is closed. So I cannot exchange the kurti. So I'm planning to buy a new footwear for myself. 
so I'll just go and get that. So I have uh, finally bought uh, some footwear for myself. I'll just show it once I uh, get back home. Now we'll go to have some food first and then we'll uh, go for the tattoo. We have had our food, we had KFC today and I'm asking my brother to come in the vlog but he's really camera shy and he's not agreeing to it. So now we are going to uh, do the one thing that we came out for. I'm finally gonna go get my tattoo done and uh, yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so finally the tattoo is done. Uh, I'll get back home and then I'll show you what the tattoo looks like. I am very very happy with both my tattoos. I got two tattoos, one on this hand and one on the other one. And I'm really really happy with how, the, how they came out. Uh, I'll just get back home once I'm uh, done eating something again. And uh, then I'll catch you in a bit. Hi, so it is a two days after the previous clip. Today is Monday. Now I got back home that day and I was very very tired and plus I had a little few things to do at home. So I didn't get the time to film and then uh, yesterday was Sunday and it was a very very lazy Sunday. So I just slept the whole day, read a book in the evening and that was about it. I just didn't feel like uh, shooting yesterday. Here I am to reveal uh, the two tattoos that I got and I'm really really excited to show you all the two tattoos that I got. But before that uh, you know that uh, I couldn't exchange the kurti because the stall got closed I mean like it just got closed in just a week and uh, I just have to get it fit now my, my mom will do that for me and then I went to shopper stop and I got two footwear for me so I'll just show you that uh, so the first one I got from a brand called Hote Curry I hope I'm pronouncing it right it is Hote Curry and I got a flat footwear so this is what they look like very very pretty uh, flat with the holographic uh, design to it and it is very very pretty like i can wear it with any indian wear it will go really really well even with a uh, jeans maybe but i bought it for the purpose that they will suit really really well with my ethnic outfits and uh, mostly because my brother uh, liked it a lot and he was like you just have to get it it is very very pretty and he was like uh, if uh, boys could have worn uh, such footwear I would have definitely got one for myself so I was like Chal, hai, itta keh rahe, to le leta hai. so I got this one and I got another pair of heel for myself I can never have too many heels like uh, so I got this one from the brand called lemon and pepper uh, so both of these are from shopper stop so these are what the heels look like. They are very very pretty. I'm just in love with them. It is a very very pretty grey colour. And here it has a reflective uh, design to it. Uh, this strap and also the heel. The block uh, also has the reflective thing. And they look very 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 pretty. These were in a lot of different shades. And there was one that I really really liked a lot. Uh, this part was kind of navy blue. And this was very holographic. It has all the seven colors. It was uh, that way reflective. And it was very very pretty. But I don't know. It looked pretty uh, to see. But when I wore both of them. I like this one better. So I got this one for me. Uh, these were the two footwears that I got. Now coming to the part that I am most excited about. And I hope you are too. So I got one tattoo here and one tattoo on this hand. Uh, so 
the first tattoo that I got is So this is written in Punjabi. It says Nirbha Nirvair which means without fear, without hatred. Now uh, I have always wanted this tattoo. Like I knew for a fact that whenever I'm going to get a tattoo on myself, this would be the first tattoo. But initially I had planned to get it here on my arm but then uh, the tattoo artist and my brother suggested that it would look better here so I went for this and I'm really really obsessed with how it looks like it looks very very pretty and I am really really obsessed with how it turned out and I just love it so yeah this was the first tattoo that I got and uh, the second tattoo that I got is It is a very very pretty small semicolon. It is a very small tattoo but it holds a very uh, deep meaning and uh, I really really like how it turned out. Now I was again I was planning to get it here but then because my hand moves and this area moves a lot so he told me that the tattoo might get faded soon. So then I got it here and it looks very very pretty. So the semicolon holds meaning that it is not the end. The story still remains. Mary Kahani abhi baki hai. So that was the thought process that went behind this tattoo. I wanted this tattoo for about like one year and a half. I knew I wanted to get a semicolon. So these were the two tattoos that I knew I had to get them. Uh, this for a very very long time. This for one and a half year. So I got both of them done. And now coming to the pain part. Okay. So before I went for getting the tattoo uh, I had discussed it with a couple of friends and they told and they just scared me like uh, they told me that it is gonna pain a lot uh, and all the best and this and that so I went there and I was scared a lot like I was literally terrified when I went there but it started and I was like it didn't pain I mean obviously it did pain but it didn't pain as much as I thought it would like um, if I would put it into words even when I get threading done on my eyebrows that pain is far more than the pain that I got while getting a tattoo so it was very bearable so it was not that much but this tattoo pained a lot more than this one but both of them were still bearable so the pain factor I guess it is nothing if you are planning to get a tattoo just go get it done it does not pain a lot lot and it was a pretty pretty good experience and I'm happy with how both my tattoos turned out you let me know in the comments box below which tattoo you like more and if you have a tattoo or not and what meaning it holds behind so I want to know it uh, so just uh, drop your comments down below I hope this year comes with a lot lot good luck for me uh, wish me the same in the comments box below so this is all the little bits that I am doing for my birthday I am uh, trying to be as excited as possible I want my birthday to go really really well this time so yeah with this I'll end this video here and stay tuned for the part 2 the birthday vlog that will be up soon on my channel till then drop your wishes my birthday is on 12th February you can wish me here and on my Instagram as well I will be very very happy receiving each and every one of your wishes again I'm being very very shameless and I'm asking for a birthday gift uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and click the notification bell right next to it so that you get notified every time I upload a new video like the video drop your comment share this video and all the good stuff it would mean the world to me Thank you so much for watching this video. I will see you super super soon in my next video. Till then stay safe, stay healthy. Bye bye.